hey loves welcome back to my channel first of all i want to thank you guys so much because you have shown me so much love and so much support and positive feedback when i started this channel i didn't know what was going to happen i didn't know what kind of feedback i was going to get i didn't know what kind of audience i was going to have but i knew that this was something that i wanted to do for so long so thank you so much for everyone with the positive feedback and the ideas and things that you guys want me to show you and do uh is beyond real so appreciated so today i'm going to be showing you guys my most requested skincare regimen um i get a lot of questions on what i put on my skin what i do to my skin but first and foremost i want to say that i do get pimples i do get breakouts i do get discoloration i am a human being i get the normal stuff that everybody does i just know how to take care of my skin i can't stress it enough is drink plenty of water i know how tempting it is to get that lemonade or get that tea or you know get that soda but water is the number one thing that our bodies need water is very very good for the skin so first i am here with oily skin i have been at work all day and i've been in the heat and the sun the only makeup that i have on right now is my eyebrows and the first thing i'm gonna do is take the equate makeup remover wipes so I'm just going to wipe off all the dirt and oil and my eyebrows. Bye bye eyebrows. So the first thing I'm going to be using is the night relaxing, the night relaxing uh, deep cleansing face wash. I have repurchased this so many times. You guys do not understand. This is my favorite, favorite, favorite face wash. And the next thing that I have is going to be the oil free acne wash from Neutrogena. Now with this one, I only use this on my problem areas and my problem areas are down here where I get most of my pimples and breakouts. Um, this is where I only use this because it is an acne face wash. I don't want to dry out the rest of my skin. Now that all of that is washed off my face, now to the fun part. I'm going to be using the Peter Thomas Roth Rose Stem Cell Mask. So I'm going to put this on my face. Um, one thing I can say is that Peter Thomas Roth is expensive, but with Peter Thomas Roth, they always have some kind of sample sale. And with that sample, they'll have like the cucumber, the Irish mud, they'll have the 24 karat gold. They'll have all these different masks in a set so that you can try them out and save money. I remember where I got this from, but it's a little scooper and I use this for pretty much any kind of mask or, um, moisturizer that comes in a jar so I don't have to get it all under my nails and stuff. And I am just going to put a generous amount. So I am back. I have washed the uh, rose stem cell mask off my face. As you can see, it's a little bit brighter. I hope you can see it, but my skin feels so smooth and it just feels oh, so luxurious right now. I do sheet mask in between the Peter Thomas Roth rose stem cell mask so that I can save a couple of coins so I don't go through it as fast. But again, I do use that 
faithfully. The Paper Sheet Mask brands that I use are Yes to Carrots. I love the Yes to Carrots. Most of these that I'm going to show you are from Yes to Carrots. And they are $2.50 at Walmart. So there you go. Saving the coins. Bang for your buck. So the first one here is the Yes to Carrots Tomato Mask. This one here helps with acne. So when I'm just, my skin is going through it. I will use this one for my entire face especially when my chin is going through it and I just want to cry and just have a meltdown I will use that um, this one here is good this is the detoxifying charcoal mud mask I use this one a lot too um, it does a lot with getting rid of the excess oils in my t-zone and it also helps the breakouts at the bottom too another one is the uh, cucumber uh, calming mask I normally don't have an issue with dry skin so I get this more so just to add extra moisture to my face even if your skin is moisturized we always need moisture just like our hair um, you can never have too much moisture in your hair as long as you have balance with it another one is the vitamin C glow boosting I mentioned this earlier in uh, my snapchat videos about vitamin C I buy anything that has vitamin C my Clinique Vitamin C Booster, I actually threw away because it was old and it was time to get rid of it. Skin Active Moisture Balm. Yeah, Moisture Balm. I have not tried this one yet, but it looks so uh, interesting that I want to try it. We are going to move on to the uh, Rapid Spot Treatment. Can you see that? There we go. So this here is the Murad. I only use this for spot treatments on my face. I don't use it all over the face, though you can use it all over the face. I just don't find a need that I need it all over the face. So what I'm going to do is just put this on my um, acne scars or acne um, discoloration. Any kind of discoloration. Sometimes I'll use this on my neck too because my neck gets a little discolored. So I'll use this on my neck as well. But I'm going to put this on my pimples that have dried up and just left the mark. <music> Neutrogena Hydro Boost Gel, this is my favorite, and I mean favorite, moisturizer. And the eye cream I'm using is the Renewing Eye Cream from Murad. Again, this is a bit on the pricier side, but I'll, I use the littlest amount under my eyes. This is going to last me till the end of the year. So since I have nails and I don't want it under my nails and I can't like get in here without poking myself in the eye with the nails, I take it on my little knuckle here. This is the amount that I take. Can you see that? This is the amount that I take on my finger and put it under both eyes. What I want to talk about is the Persa Gel 10 from Clean and Clear. This here is a lifesaver. And it's a lifesaver because you are going to have those pimples that come out of nowhere. And you're going to be like, okay, what the heck just happened? How do I get rid of this? I personally don't use toothpaste. I have a lot of people tell me that toothpaste works for them, but I'm no, I'm I'm not gonna to put toothpaste on my face. So this here is the Persia gel. It is 10% benzoyl peroxide, which helps get all the bad gunk and stuff out of that one spot. This is I use this as a spot treatment. I do not put this all over my face. I use this. I will squeeze out a little bit, and I will put it on the problem area. Here we go. Put it on that problem area, and then I will sleep overnight with it. And then, of course, we can't forget about our lips. You know, we got to have soft and juicy lips. Mine are too big to be to be ashy so I use any kind of lip chap that I can find <laughs> that's in reach so that is the end of my skincare routine that was highly requested I hope you liked it please leave any comments in the bottom bar and any kind of suggestions or anything that you want to see next so that I can get that out to you guys okay.